द स्मार्ट स्कूल क्लास थ्री साइंस वीडियो लेसन वन वी शेल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम चैप्टर वन विच इज अर्थ एज अ लिविंग प्लेनेट द टॉपिक ऑफ स्टडी इज द फैक्टर्स रिक्वायर्ड टू सस्टेन लाइफ ऑन अर्थ वी विल स्टडी पेजेस वन एंड टू you will require smart science 3 your notebook and pencils before the start of this lesson are you ready by the end of this lesson you should be able to identify five factors that support life on earth determine what kind of temperature conditions do living organisms needed to survive and describe how light water air and soil play their part in sustaining the life on earth factors required to sustain life on earth are sunlight water air temperature and soil these are the basic needs of a living organism living things cannot survive if any of these things is not available life will not be possible if these factors are not available can you rename these factors with me these factors are number 1 temperature what is the second one it is light third one is water the fourth one is air and the fifth one is soil how are you feeling today are you feeling hot or are you feeling cold temperature of the surroundings makes you feel cold or hot all living things need to live in a particular temperature if the temperature is too cold as the case here we cannot survive and if it is too hot again it will be difficult for us to live on living things cannot survive if the temperature is too high or it is too low so the temperature on earth is just right for the life to happen here you see the distance of the sun and the earth is just right if it had been to the left the temperature conditions would be too hot for the life to go on and if would it would have been on the right the temperature would have been too cold for the life to survive the distance of earth from the sun is the most appropriate to sustain life on earth another factor important for life is light during day time there is light where does this light come from you can see this is the picture of a day the light that you see is coming from the sun the sunlight comes from the sun sun is the main source of light and heat on the earth so where does this light come from the light that we see on the earth comes from the sun what would happen if there is no sun our earth will look like this other than this you see this is a living planet with greenery and water none of this would be there if there is no sun if there is no sun there would be no light and no heat plants would not be able to grow and animals would not be able to get food eventually all the living things would die water is another important factor of life 
Why do living things need water? Animals cannot survive without drinking water. And plants, they need water to make their food. So without water, plants and animals cannot survive. Water in human body. Do you know how much of our body is made of water? About 70% of our body is made of water. That is how important water is for us. Without water, we will not be able to live for more than three days. All living things need air. Let's see how long you can hold your breath. Maybe for five seconds or 10 seconds. Well, maybe for 30 seconds. Eventually, you have to let the air in. So you had to breathe in because all living things need air. Why do plants need air? Do plants also breathe in and breathe out like us? Plants need air to make their food. Plants use sunlight and water along with air to make their own food. Soil. You saw in the previous picture the plant was standing. Where does that plant get its support to stand on? That support is provided by the soil. Soil provides support to plants. They take nutrients from the soil as well as the support. So the plant, when it is very small, start getting its roots out. As the roots go in, into the soil, the plant keeps growing. Can you name some animals that live in the soil? Ants and rabbits are some of the animals that live in the soil. That is how they make their homes in the soil and they live underground. So soil not only supports the plants it also provides home to many of the animals. So now we will assess what we have learned so far. The first question is, which of the following groups of living things can make their own food? Is it the plants or is it the animals? The correct answer is, Plants are the living things that make their own food. Another question is, which of the following places are most suitable for living things? Is it the extremely cold places like this one or places with moderate temperature like this one or extremely hot places like the picture shown here. The correct answer is places with moderate temperature are the most suitable for living things. Another question is which of the following is the biggest source of energy for us? Is it the sun or is it the moon? The correct answer is the sun is the biggest source of energy that is heat and light for all the living things on the earth. We shall now summarize what we have learned so far in this lesson. Life on earth depends on temperature, light, water, air and soil. Living things cannot survive if it is too cold or too hot. Sun is the main source of light. Plants use sunlight to, to make food. 
Water, air and soil are important for all the living things on earth. Your home task is to read from pages 1 and 2 of the textbook. Attempt exercise question C1 on page 4 of the textbook on your notebooks. This is the picture of that question that you have to attempt. Good luck!